Dollar Tree that was only a dollar. <laughs> so I came in KB and it only has the colors that I'm going to show you once I change it. Um, this is off I came in KB by the KB Mills, close to me, the KB Mills Mall. 20. Okay, so the first color I'm going to show you is um, a purple. They're all neon colors. This is the neon purple. <laughs> Ha 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 on the camera, but it's like tan. Tan in the six pack. Unfortunately, it's only the only colors that I'm showing you. Next, we have this neon yellow. It's really bright, really cool, but I have a bright one in there. Um, next, we have the lime green. It's really good. <laughs> and I like to know the green and the blue. Um, this would go good with like colored like pink and red. You want to make one for Christmas, being pink and red. I mean, green and red. <laughs> and then, last but not least, for the pack, I have this one. It's, this is one. It's really bright. Go up, I think, Kaylee, close to me, I think. You can find it in the craft section. And if you can't find those at Dollar Tree, you can go to Walmart and get like an 18 pack or something like that. Um, and the reason I say that is because, um, because, like, they only have six for a dollar. That's a good price. But, if I was to go on Walmart, on the Walmart account, on the Walmart thing, it would show me, like, other types of things that they have. Which is really cool. Um, so, yeah. So, they would have to show me, like, other things, like 20 packs and 18 packs and... Why do take it? Okay, next we have this color. It's already cut up to go with another color. It's pretty long. You can't see it in the whole camera, but I think you can see the whole cut in half. You can see it. Okay, well, you can. Yeah, it's Third. This is going to go with purple. I think yellow and purple go good together. Because it's like a dark color, maybe a bright color, which means, <laughs> see, if, if I measure it there, it's even. So, we're going to, I'm going to show you this one. This is a glow in the dark, so the ugly color here was not I actually made one with the glow in the dark. Let me show it to you last. Here we have a circle square, circle square that I'm starting. But so far, all I have is purple. It's like it's the clear seed for green and pink. You can obviously tell the difference between this and then this. This is kind of see through. It's a little bit like this. Okay. And then we have this one. And I'm like, I'm almost finished. All circles. All circles. It's really, really cool. The other one that I have is this. About 15 feet. They hold it off. Real easy to untangle. Takes about a minute to untangle, but who cares? Right now, well, it's like a red see-through color. 
And the reason, the reason um, it's see-through is because like sometimes you may want to like, like you want may want to put it a darker color. Okay, it's see-through because that, and then another reason, which I don't know that reason. So, yeah. Um, another one that I have made is this one. This one is a box square. Box square. And on my other videos, you see you can make it. And then the one I have is square, circle, square, circle, as you can see. Square, circle, square, circle. You can make that one too. And that is my favorite. I made it just yesterday. It's called the zipper. <laughs> It's really cool. Goes kind of like this. Kind of like the zipper. You can see it like that. It's good. It's good. Yeah, that's my favorite because it's like really cool. I just got like fascinated. Um, I didn't see. It was too short. I didn't know if you this. And then I had to connect other pieces of the same color together. Because it was like, well, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. And so that's basically my collection of lanyard strings. I may go buy some. Yeah, bye.